systems. Oh my god! He aimed his enormous battering ram at the opening of her gates and began the attack. Holy shit! <laughs> Yo, this looks like the soy jack. Adjust brightness slider until the symbol is barely visible. All right, this is Tainted Grail, the fall of Avalon. Let's go ahead and start a new game. We'll start at the prologue. All right, so here is the character selection. So, I don't know, this, this girl looks kind of sad. Let's change it up a bit. All right, this is the best I can do. They have a long way to go with character creation, but we're gonna rock with this, all right? She looks nice, she looks very humble. All right, let's turn off motion blur, chromatic aberration, and depth of field. This is pretty much required in every game. It automatically set me on ultra everything, but we just got to turn all that shit off. Let's be honest. Look, we just have to get this over and done with. Unless you want a visit from someone upstairs. And trust me, you don't. Just like before, no food until we're done here. And the moment you start getting on my nerves, we're going back to my tried and tested fists. So, tell me, what were you doing? Oops, I accidentally skipped the dialogue, the end of the dialogue. Um, what was I doing? So I guess this is to create my character's backstory. Oh wait, these are there's actually stats attached to this. I was on my way to enlist in the army. I was hunting, avoiding city guards. So this is, okay, so this is like soldier-like. This is for bows. You can tell because of the stats on the side. Um, so if I stay silent, then I get no stat bonuses on anything. I think I'm going to go for like a big two-handed weapon type person, so let's go for it. Army, huh? If I were in charge, I wouldn't even consider letting you join the ranks. I'd rather feed you to the dogs. Less waste. And you were planning to enlist with... All right, so looking through all these options, it looks like... So in my head, I want to play like a big two-handed berserker. And I've always known them to use like medium armor. So I'm going to select one of these that specializes in medium armor. Hopefully that goes well. I think archers might be the best way to go here. But I expected that coming from you. Okay. That was easier than I expected. Now, unfortunately, we'll have to start. Hell yeah. Get fucked. I always found it puzzling that these people won't bathe. You, I understand, you're literally rotting in this damned cell, but them, there's just no excuse for the stench. There they are, finally. I know, I know, you have a million questions forming in your head, but they'll have to wait. One of these keys will open your cell. When you get out, head left. I'll scout ahead. Got it. I can't loot anything. Oh, I looted a bucket. No, in Skyrim, playing with the physics was fun, but it only took you so far. All right. Let's equip all this now. Oh no, I just dropped all of them. Okay, how do I equip these? All right, I guess I have to click here. So here we go. So he told me to go left, but you know what? I want to check out what's over to the right here. Beautiful Liliana in the Chamber of Ecstasy. This sounds vaguely erotic. 
Sir Osbert pushed down his pants and took out the weapon a man uses to lay love siege. He aimed his enormous battering ram at the opening of her gates and began the attack. Holy shit. <laughs> All right. Let's keep going. Oh, a zombie. What's a zombie doing in here? Oh, tortured. Damn. I'm pretty sure all these rooms I'm visiting has important stuff for me to learn the game, but I'm in exploration mode right now. Okay. Lockpick. Oh, fuck. There we go. So it's kind of similar to Elder Scroll games. This looks like if there is a if there is a hidden door, the hidden door would be here. What? Ooh. Okay. How do I crawl? All right. What is down here? Oh, this is just uh. The enemy is near. <laughs> oh god damn Wait now I can dual weld clubs ah, I'm a true berserker now Ooh, and there's more there's another hole here was this actually the correct way was there a dead end the other way you know what? Let's go find out. You took your sweet time. Eh? Oh shit! Well, now I, I talk to him. I did too when I was leaving this place for the first time. You have to admit the red priests are quite resourceful when it comes to death and dying. Who are you anyway? Great question, truly. But in case you haven't noticed, we're still within the walls of the island asylum. When we're out. Then we'll talk. I'm told this path leads to the beach. I don't know how, but if it's true, then I'll wait there for you until dusk. Good luck. Okay, so that that way that I went downstairs here is the way to go. Let me see what's back there. I have discovered a room that is totally not cool. All right. This is this is the reward for taking the offbeat path. You get to see some cool little um, environmental lore, environmental storytelling. What the, where the hell is this? Oh, I know where this is. Okay. I never even know this is this door on the way down. Damn. Damn, son. All right. Nothing for me there. What the fuck is all this? Word plasm. It's down here. Oh. Down here is just the same place. I assume I'd want to get across there somehow. Let me guess. This lets me get... Oh, I have to hold this? I don't quite understand. Maybe I have to do something to enhance that bridge that's being formed. What is this? Very shiny. All right, so there's got to be something down here. Yeah, get boned. Take that. All right. 
Oh god, what did I just do? Oh, I zoned into a new place? What the hell is this? Where the fuck am I? Where in the butterscotch fuck am I? Well, I'm in the same place, but it's all fucking weird. This place is fantastic. What is this? You know what this reminds me of? Can you take me higher? That's what it reminds me of. Okay, so this is probably at the same exact location as it was in the previous, like, dimension. I don't know, do you call it a dimension? Okay. Oh my god, what the fuck is all this? I've been waiting a long time for someone to find me. Are you here to help me leave this place? You're a prisoner? I might be. I do not know. Was I sent here for a reason? Did I end up here by accident? Like you. What are you? What is this place? I do not know. I think it is some kind of prison deep in the weirdness. What are you? remember. I know I am not complete. I remember I once knew who I was at some point, but I do not anymore. I just am. Why do you want to leave? I've been here for what seems like an eternity. I feel I am getting restless. Why are you here? Why are you here? Because I clicked a fucking thing and it sent me. <laughs> That's exactly what I was thinking. I've been transported by here by a morbid statue. A man here that would explain the weirdness surrounding us. You are looking for a way out yourself. I think we might be able to help one another with that. I shall do something now. But trust me, the discomfort will be worth the outcome. Damn, temporal hold unlocked. What is temporal hold? Is that a place or is it a spell? This guy looks like sexy Squidward. All right. Am I allowed to press this button now? <gasps> it works. Cool. Well, that's kind of a weird way to gate the progression. There, I remember on the other side of this, there was like a... Uh, wall of roots or something like that so what do i do now do i go back to where i was before or or what stays there all right what is that someone uh sacrificed them oh my god you know what this kind of reminds me of this kind of reminds me of the uh that last dungeon in heaven's word it's just so cool. Hell yeah, I'll take this. Pairing is one of the most useful skills in combat. It allows you to avoid all damage. Okay. Block right before the enemy attack reaches you. All right, so I assume that there's gonna be an enemy appearing. All right. Oh, that's too early. Temporal hold allows you to slow down time. Use it however you want to attack, escape, and so on. But remember, once you use it, it will need to be recharged. Recharge it by killing enemies. 
All right, so what is temporal hold? Temporal hold is middle mouse wheel. Oh, this is like San Devastan. I gotta stop comparing everything to other games. I am sorry I did not ask for your permission to do that, but I hope it was worth it, as promised. What are you? It seems that I am a piece of a shattered soul, judging by my abilities. I used to belong to what your kind would call a four-dweller. If four dwellers are so good, why aren't there five dwellers? I have already told you. I need your help to leave this place. And when we are out of here, I will need your help finding the rest of me to make me whole again. I feel I am but a shadow of what I once was. How am I supposed to find the rest of you? Look for what is left of me whenever you step into the weirdness. I know your kind tends to avoid it, but you do not have to be afraid. I will be your shield against the darkness. Hell yeah, brother. Whatever we leave. I will try to help as much as I can, but I need you to hold up your end of the bargain. Um, sure, let's go for it. Thank you. We shall meet again then. Find the weirdness and look for me within the darkness. The darkness. All right. Okay. Damn, this place is fucking wild, though. All right. So this just opens that door. Oh, now this is blocked off. Man, I'll really have to gate everything. Come on. I wonder if it's safe to walk across it immediately. Or if I have to wait a few seconds. Let's try that right now. Alright. We're going to test now if we can actually walk across the bridge instantly. Yeah, you can. All right, cool. We did it. What the fuck? Yo, this looks like the soy jack. <laughs> All right, so what are these two things doing? It looks like there's a machine that they are powering. Despite all the jokes and stuff, like, this is a very brutal aesthetic. I like it so much. It's a very nice aesthetic. I like that the chains are physically correct. These are biblically accurate chains. There's a person down there. Alright, person, what do you want? Oh. All right. Rusty short sword to inflict tetanus. Okay, I'm out. That was a weird way to get out. But I'll take it. All right, at least let's meet these friendly people with my weapon sheathed. There she is. Now that we're all here, meet your new comrades, conquer in Syria, get some rest, people, and 
prepare for the journey. We're leaving at dusk. Not so fast, brother. I'm not getting near a goddamn boat unless I know where I'm going. Away from here, brother. Isn't that enough? A free wish. But since we're all here and we have some time to kill, it would be nice if you finally explained what the hell's going on. You've helped us leave our cages, great. But even though we're grateful, you owe us an explanation. What do you want from us? To show some damn gratitude for one thing. Caradoc, we weren't born yesterday. No one would risk getting into trouble with the priests for nothing. Why did you save us? I need you to kill King Arthur. You're insane. He's insane. The King Arthur that has already been dead for 600 years, King Arthur. Precisely. But he's dead. You probably wouldn't have heard about it among the tribes little picked, but every single time things go down the shitter on this island, a bunch of cowards in Camelot bring our once and future king back from the dead. It's happened before, it will happen again, and soon. What a load of... <sighs> ah, fine. Have it your way. Let's say I believe you. You can't be serious. He believes that. There's no point in arguing with a madman, but that still doesn't explain. What do you mean? He exactly explained it. Kind of I wish I knew why I was ordered to save you three specifically. Personally, I don't see the appeal, but I don't question my orders. And if you get on my boat, you won't question mine. Understood? Now get some rest. The tide's not right just yet, but it will break and start working in our favor by dusk. Fine. But where are we going, exactly? To the Horns of the South. Nice. A bunch of glorified fishermen who hate my people. Why would we stop there? Do they teach you, Del Reader, anything? To take the Excalibur, obviously. Obviously. He's truly insane. You'll see for yourselves soon enough. Now pin these emblems to your clothes. They will grant you free passage to the Horns. And get some sleep. You all look like you're about to keel over. And we have a long journey ahead of us. From now on, whenever you'd like to rest all up or cook something, you're able to set up a bonfire. Alright. So I guess I have to set up a bonfire in order to level up. So how do I do that? Looks like I will be going for all the two-handed weapon stuff. Stats. All right. I, do I have to use the bonfire to level up my stats? All right. Let's go. You have decided to trust Caradoc, at least for now. You have embarked on your journey towards the Horns of the South. But as soon as you found yourselves at sea, black clouds gathered over your heads, like tangible proof that there must be some curse on you. Soon the wind was howling, and the gargantuan waves were towering over you. You found yourselves in the heart of a storm. The only thing you remember is the deafening roar of cracking wood and then darkness. All right, so I'm at the shadow of the horns, or no? I don't. I don't think so. What's my crash tracker? Tra tra tracker say? Oh, I have a map. I have a nice little map here. I wonder where I was initially. What's this red zone here? I guess I must investigate. Red probably means danger. Are you dangerous? But if it turns out there's nothing here, I'll be really pissed off. What are you on about? The stone itself is valuable. Yeah, but we've been swinging for so long that I'd like to see something more than just a pile of rocks. Well, you won't find out unless we finish the job, so stop moaning while dig itself. What are you doing here? Get lost. This is our spot. 
I don't think y'all want to talk me off. I'm probably more powerful than you both combined twice over. None. We're just doing maintenance. What's it to you? You must have had a pickaxe dropped on your head long before you came here. Um... Let's do this. I told you to get lost. Now leave or I'll crush your skull. Try me. Bam, baby. Heavy boots. Uh, sure. Cool. I will take that. I do have a pickaxe on me, right? I think I do. I'm not using stamina when I use this. I don't even know if I'm making progress. I'm not sure if I'm making progress at all. Okay, so I can hit this. Cool. So I think the mining prompt was misplaced. Oh no, it's right here. Okay, that's what's happening. What's all this? All right, I am going to continue on my path I don't think I really accomplished anything. Oh, this isn't even the place with the red blob. This is a totally different place. Okay. Oh, it's a lake of blood. Blood lake. Very apt name. All right, we finally made it to town. Let me, uh, stow away my weapon. What the fuck? Ah, stay away from... Oh my god. What's happening? Why did they have him outside the gate? name it, old mother. What are you doing? I could have stabbed you. Wait. I haven't seen you before. Not, uh, I'm not. Uh, I could have sliced you up like a fish. Uh, no, uh, oh, like a potato. But I didn't, did I? Mm. But we don't just let anybody in, pal. You need to have, uh, oh, uh, th uh things, uh, oh, oh, proof, uh, oh, things to prove. You, you're safe F for Haven. Yeah. Oh, this pin. Uh, I can't say I see it very clearly right now. Uh, oh, but it looks important. Very official. <laughs> but I remember Fergus said something about this. Th these uh, emblems. What? Oh, oh, yes, I remember now. I. I welcome thee, ye, uh, royal person, on behalf of the keepers. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> you are a great friend to our old. <laughs> welcome. Please speak with Fergus. He's our quartermaster. He runs things round here in the captain's absence. He'll greet uh, oh, thee properly. Have a pleasant day. Uh, rest of the day <laughs> open it up boys yep all right this guy this guard is worthless sir i haven't seen you before i wasn't expecting any guests you don't look like a new recruit and yet children let you in he's not drinking again i hope he was pretty drunk. Most unfortunate. But that explains why you just strutted into the horns. I'm afraid I'll have to take action. The name's Fiergus. And I assume you already know that I'm the quartermaster here. Now, state your business. And please, try to be convincing. Or the walls of this fortress will be the last thing you'll ever see. 
Yes, I know. And that's why you're still standing in front of me. However, these pens were only given to certain people. They mean that in times of trouble, these people will always find a safe haven here in the horns. And this makes me wonder, what happened to your friend? If what you're saying is true, he must have had a deal with someone well above my pay grade. And that leaves only the captain. However, if you're lying, then you might as well have just confessed to the murder of a knight of the round table. But nobody's that much of a fool, I think. Fortunately for you, I've seen my fair share of morons in life, and you don't look like one. Fortunately for me, this pen only means that I'm to make sure you're safe in the horns. Nothing about helping you out with whatever you're up to. And let me guess. If you have friends among the knights, then you'll be wanting to talk to the captain, right? Well, that ain't happening anytime soon. Why? Because I said so. What? Did you really expect that you could just enter our keep and head straight for the captain's quarters? There wouldn't be much point in having walls and guards here if anyone could just do that, would there? Anyway, welcome to the Horns of the South. Make yourself at home. So it will take for you le to let me talk to the captain. First of all, you have to prove yourself trustworthy and capable. I can't let just anyone into the captain's quarters. He's a very busy man, you see. I don't want to waste his time. Fine, what needs to do? I'm having trouble with the dead lately. The kind that don't want to rest in peace. There are more and more of them roaming the area. It might just be the weirdness, as it has been steadily creeping closer from the north, but somehow I doubt it. Seems like the problem lies in the old cemetery. As far as I know, the fog hasn't reached it yet. You could go there and find out what's happening. Hell yeah, it's quest time. Try not to get yourself killed and get rid of whatever's been causing the problem. Here, hi, hi. Please let me sell my junk. Boy, friend, because he. <laughs> wow, that was a good pun, and I fucking skipped past it. Of course. I didn't expect the merchant to have lore. I'm Osbricht, the local. All right, I'm gonna cut this right here. I want to say thank you for watching. Next video, we'll have us start off at the cemetery. I think this is a pretty cool game, so look forward to more. Highly recommend it.